Breaking now, Deep State just busted with memo overnight. They're being hauled out of D.C. by Amanda Shea for FreedomDaily.com. The release of the much-anticipated FISA memo and impending doom for Democrats became a terrifying reality for the Deep State in Washington, D.C. After President Donald Trump was caught on hot mic at the State of the Union saying he was 100% going to release it. It was a confirmation that the secrets to their overwhelming corruption that will expose a bigger scandal in Watergate was coming uh, fast to fruition. Just like the memo proves their dishonesty, what these corrupt politicians just pulled last night shows just how far they're willing to go to hide what they didn't want uh, out. Now we know why. The only thing a desperate trader can do to keep their corruption covered up is to employ more illegal activity to do it. That's exactly what took place overnight when they were caught with the memo in a deliberate effort to destroy one major detail. Clearly, Democrats will stop at nothing, but in this case, neither will a Republican rhino. What this traitor just did is even more shocking than the details that the memo itself contains. There's never been more proof of corruption than what uh, Representative Devin Nunez was just uh, caught red-handed in turning on his own party and the president after busting Nunez with the memo initial report said he had altered it what although that's bad enough it's not uh it's now come out that what he actually did was worse but was all this part of a plan to stop the release of the memo thanks to Nunez democrats have uh, flipped the script on the memo uh, controversy saying his motivation is to interfere with the Russia probe. Senate Minority uh, Leader uh, Charles E. Schumer, New York Democrat. Perhaps they put Nunez up to it so they could turn the scandal around on Republicans. Since it's been reported that Trump has read the memo, maybe he can shine some light on the situation and shut liberals down. It sounds like it's now going to be a while before any of the rest of us sees the memo. NBC News reports. I, 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 I'm I just listening, hearing about that. What are they talking about? The House Intelligence Committee sent the White House a different version of, the, of a classified memo about the Trump-Russia investigation from the uh, one that committee uh, Republicans voted to release to the public. The committee's top Democrat said Wednesday night, Representative Adam Schiff, the Intelligence Committee's ranking Democrats said in an open letter to the committee, Chairman Representative Nunez, that the situation is deeply troubling and the memo should be withdrawn immediately. The committee voted Monday to release the memo, which was uh, prepared by Republicans on a straight party line vote. The memo is under White House review. The final decision on whether to make it public rests on uh, with the President uh, Trump. Uh, multiple White House officials told NBC News that uh, Trump had read, has read the FISA memo and delivered it to the White House. Although everyone in America is waiting to see the damning document, there now will be a delay in releasing it as this latest attempt to deter the inevitable from happening gets sorted out. Nunez better not have his job by the end of the day according to the official notice he received after being busted what things are definitely not looking good for this criminal who was now who has now been accused on now not just altering the document but switching it out altogether with a new one what he's adam schiff is telling talking about Nunez. Oh, they, they, who's going to believe Adam Schiff? Discovered late uh, tonight that Chairman Nunez made material changes to the memo he sent to the White House. Changes not approved by the committee White House, therefore uh, reviewing a document the committee has not approved for release. Uh, the Washington Times reported in a letter to Chairman Devin Nunez of California that he later posted on Twitter, Representative Adam Schiff of California said that the panel's Democrats had just learned that evening that the memo sent to the White House for Justice and National Security officials to review 
was not the same document the committee had voted on. It is clear that the Republican majority made material changes to the version it sent to the White House, which committee members were never apprised of, Mr. Schiff's letter said. White House is therefore reviewing a document the committee has not approved for release, Mr. Schiff wrote on Twitter. A Nunez spokesman dismissed the concerns, telling CNN that the uh, changes were not substantive and some even requested by the Democrats. In uh, its increasingly strange attempt to thwart uh, publication of the memo, the committee minority is now complaining about minor edits to the memo, including grammatical fixes and two edits requested by the FBI and by the minority themselves, spokesman uh, Jack Langer said. Mr. Schiff's tweet accused Mr. Nunez personally of making the changes, though uh, his letter, which called them deeply troubling, is less specific. Mr. Schiff's letter concludes that the changes make it now imperative that the committee immediately withdraw the document that it sent to the White House and hold a new vote. Otherwise, the letter claims there is no longer a valid basis for the executive branch to review the Nunez memo, which reportedly accuses the FBI of misconduct designed to hurt President Trump in the uh, presidential election. The fact that the majority found it necessary to make these changes without informing the committee during those uh, the vote signifies that the committee majority no longer stands by the representation it made to the House members. In its original document, the letter said, this scandal is getting more corrupt by the hour. What are they talking about? They're blaming Nunez? This article is blaming Nunez? What a joke. We know what Adam Schiff is going to say. Why would Nunez change it? This is this article is like weird. Like, what are they talking about? Of course, Adam Schiff is going to make these uh, these uh, accusations against Nunez, and the article saying that Nunez is a corrupt criminal. Uh, this is like this is crazy. I got to look into this because I've seen this part of uh, Adam Schiff. So, so in other words, the deep state's going to win again. Schiff is going to win. Uh, I gotta look into this. This is like, uh, this is mind-boggling. Uh, I don't know what the, they're talking about. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.